begin the story. Danger room? What the hell is that? RVN World News. We examine the growing mutant what? menace. It's a concern of worldwide proportions. This scene took place in Russia two weeks ago as a young mutant stood in defiance of the military. And oh. <laughs> the authorities attempted to quell an uprising at a mutant camp. But they had little success. We interrupt this newscast with a breaking story. A young woman named Allison Cressmere was identified as a mutant. The Genetic Research and Security Organization is now responding to that report. But a mob has formed and tempers are flaring. Help! Somebody help me! Mom! Mom! I'm not a mutant! I swear I'm not! Mom! Grab the girl and get out of here! Get out of here! Holy shit! Lame. Stop 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 so that's a uh, mystique and the blob. I see super my superhero knowledge is eh like I know this is Wolverine hey bub you should have called in sick today so just fucking murder him why don't you Wolverine <laughs> <laughs> all right so that's movement okay that does that okay, that looks like strong attacks Okay, and that's jump. Okay, oh, okay. Sweet. So that's my powers. Um Okay. Let's do. Nothing. What's the white button do? Oh. And I'm assuming the black button's gonna be my health, so let's not do that. Game tip! To toggle the world map, click the right thumbstick. You can you can resize the world map by clicking it a second time. Oh, oh yeah, I, yeah. Who fucking plays the, with the map dead center, for Christ's sakes. Let's see what you got. So, is, so what's with these people's problems with mutants? Not familiar with that much of X-Men lore. Many objectives in the X-Men universe can be dam- Oh, many objects in the X-Men universe can be damaged or destroyed. Some objects will drop useful items when destroyed. Well, found, fucking found that out. Is it like a Ultimate Alliance where you also have to collect coins to level up your shit? Looks like it. <laughs> Don't mind Wolverine just punching the shit out of a flipped over taxi. Oh, another thing I forgot to mention. I created a Java application and put a bunch of games that, uh... Lesson in what, asshole? Stop that. Face on Wolverine reminds me of, like, Doom. <laughs> what fucker? Pick a basic weakness analyzer. Outfit each character with beneficial equipment that will help enhance their abilities. Go to the character details screen to assign new equipment. So we need to do that by pressing pause. Okay, details. Oh, ah, okay, cool. Okay, and then we go back. What does the back... Oh, that just takes me straight to the character. Okay, sweet. Eh. What the f... 
There isn't a block button, I've noticed, which is, uh... Any objects in the X-Men universe can be picked up and thrown. Hurled objects can do damage to enemies as well as other objects. Pick up objects with the X button. Press X or A to throw the object in the direction you are facing. Larger objects require the might ability to lift. Okay. The Y button to jump. Jumping can help you get over obstacles that lie in your path. Pressing Y then B can help you clear lo longer obstacles and can be and can devastate enemies in your path with an overhead smash. Oh, okay. So it kind of kind of elongates it a bit. Health packs and energy packs are extremely important. Press the black button to restore your health. Okay, so that one I kind of figured out already. Use them sparingly. However, your allies will use health packs on their own if they're badly hurt. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Um... Oh shit, I don't even... Well, it's certainly not going to be those. Today <laughs> on RVN don't care. Time you freaks learned a lesson. Fuck you. <laughs> How many can I carry? That's the big question. Okay, that one. Let's try this. Fucker. Only my blue one is showing. Oh, is it because it's telling me, hey, dumbass? Eh. Oh, just hidden. I hope I. Time you, freaks, learn to listen. you know, it's not nice calling people freaks, so, I mean, come on. These guys are mean. I don't like that they're mean. Okay, this time I got some health to whip your ass. <laughs> Fuckers. <laughs> nope. Hey. Well, to hell he goes, I guess. What? Oh, can I not save? All that is BS. Ah. Huh. Gee, I wonder who left these. Can't move in that direction. Yeah, you can. <laughs> I feel like this is Wolverine's way of giving you the middle finger. Just shows his claws at you. I could not hear what you said. Okay. Now I can actually hear. I think. Wait, did I not save? Oh, you motherfuckers!
It's one of those. Okay. I can hear! I can hear now! Details. Fucker. Fuck plants. What have they ever done for us? Yeah. Oh! There's a pickup and go fuck yourself. Oh now god. I'm really ready for a scrap. Wolverine just summoned the power of Grayskull. Ah. Uh. Oh. Oh, sweet. Ah. I mean I can't look. What do you mean I can't put points into that? I'll put points in you. Oh, oh, okay, cool. I think I think that's a good spot. Oh, healing factor heals over time. I absolutely do want that. Thank you very much. Uh, did that save my shit? Did save my shit. Unlike the options, which does not save. What? I did not want to go that way. I just wanted to. I just wanted to destroy the trash can, but apparently that's not going to happen. I picked up that. Damn it, Wolverine! No! Fine, the trash can lives. Fuck them. Well, that uh, screwed him over. <gasps> oh! Oh, I could have thrown someone in there. Game tips. Grappling is an important element of combat. Yeah, thank you. Taking out the trash, don't worry. Okay, so it looks like 10 health I can carry. NYPD. So the X-Men universe takes place in New York? Okay. Let's see what you got. Fuck you. <laughs> Go that way. What's this shit? Oh, it's just money. Guess you didn't want a piece of me. Eh. Fuck you. Money. I hope that's money. Press A B. It's basic three hit. A B B A A A is a more advanced six hit technique. When the hell am I ever gonna hit that? You ain't getting up to that. Fuck New York Times. Stop that. <laughs> Trash can. What do you got? Side bullshit? Okay. Alright, looks like we're going in here. I guess. Still breathing. 
Is that what you call it? Pretty sure when you pierce someone with you and slice and dice someone with your claws, I don't think they're living anymore. Just putting that out there. So when, how can I, is it that bar underneath the blue that's my, like, you're about to level up meter? I'm guessing. Let's see what you got. Eh. I like hitting that uppercut. Okay, so it looks like you can only carry 10 of each. Alright. I think we'll be fine. I just gotta remember to hit them. To Central Park. Ugh! Oh, hey, Cyclops. Hey, Wolverine. Ha ha! I was gonna, I was gonna say, I'm gonna look really stupid if that's not Cyclops. What are you waiting for? Come on. What's oh, going on here? It's Mystique, dumbass. <laughs> You're finished, Mystique. Give up. Fool. You think I came here alone? Oh. Destined to lose X-Men. Endlessly beat the shit out of their corpse. I love it when you can do that in games where you're, after you're done. I think Dynasty Warriors, uh, the Dynasty Warriors games are a big offender of this, where you just endlessly beat the shit out of their corpse. <laughs> The gay is over, X-Men. You're lucky you're still breathing. Hold R to bring up the X-Men path. I don't care. Okay, I just I know that one already. Quite plain though. Oh yeah! Psh. I don't think it's never gonna stop being amusing when you knock someone into a wall or into stuff and that just breaks. Next time you ain't getting up. Ow. Not that. You ain't getting up from that. This dude's like, fuck this, I'm out. Where are you going, asshole? This isn't over. Whose voice is this, by the way? It sounds so familiar, but then again, there's gonna be a lot of voices where it, it's like. <laughs> Smoky Bear is going to destroy this man. You are destined to lose X-Men. You're lucky you're still breathing. Hoping this is one of those deals too where I can go back to like a level if I wanted to grind. Yeah. Fuck off. He man. All right, what do I want to put my point into this time? Combines with your level to increase your maximum energy and energy regeneration rate. Uh, and with your level to increase your maximum health. Increased defense. That's an odd one. Um, no, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna put it towards body. Fuck it. 
Yay. I don't want to do that. Can I pour it towards here? Damn it. Does it does it give me like a cost? Oh. Okay, I see. Requires. Sharpness adds damage and destruction to all claw attacks. <laughs> yeah. Fuck garbage. <laughs> Just polluted that. Whoops. This. Sketchbook. New artwork. Arc arc artwork? The hell? Artwork available. Colossus' room. Why am I going to Colossus' room? This garbage has, like, no physics whatsoever. Come on, Doc. Hey! New comic edition. What's this? In most cases, there are multiple ways to get past obstacles. Sometimes using force is the only way to get past tougher obstacles. Like that. Destined to lose X-Men. He says as he hurls into the fucking atmosphere. <laughs> Powers can be used to affect the environment in order to solve puzzles. If fire is blocking your path, you may need to find a way to extinguish it before moving up. Ow. Oh. <laughs> okay. Traction points can be used to change your team. Save game. Oh, okay. Save game. I'm going to save it on the top one. Okay. Get back here. You're lucky you breathe. Sorry, they got. Oop. Fuck you. I'm also going to... Uh, basic Strike Enhancer. Ooh. But also say this. Picking stuff up and just hurling them at people is also never going to be... Never going to stop being amusing, neither. Oh, you... oh. Never equipped it, that's why. The game's over, X-Men! <laughs> are you actually gonna come down and fight? Yes, you are. Fuck. Oh, she had invincibility frames, I understand. Guess you didn't want a piece of me. Okay, now come down. You know what? I'm gonna throw a trash can at you. <laughs> I can heal. Can you do that, Mystique? Not that. I'm gonna beat Mystique with the trash can. <laughs> Someday, some way, I'll see you die. You're done, darling, and I ain't even broken a sweat. Where's Blob taking the kid? She's ours now, Wolverine. You'll never see her again. 
We'll get her back, Mystique. Even if we have to cut down each and every one of you Brotherhood psychos. What's so special about her? The Crestmere child has her uses. Okay. You always got some plan brewing, don't you, Mystique? I like how in some cutscenes it just plays, but here I gotta press A. It's time to save Allison. You'll never catch Blob. <laughs> so she's just gonna lay there. Guess she's concussed after having a trash can thrown at her head. Oh, hey, are you the real Cyclops? Go ahead, there. Marine. Co op will become available when new X Men come unlocked for play. Whoa! I'm on it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Change team, save game. You better believe that if there's an object I can throw at the blob, I'm going to do that. The game's over, X-Men! Who's next? That up. I'm going to give it to you, although you're not really much of a striker. Oh, what's this? Oh, it was a basic focus. So does that remove... It does. Okay. You know what? That's fine. Oh, sweet. Just cool. Just what I need, he says. Ah, oh, goddammit. Details. Uh, yeah, you're not a striker. <laughs> yeah. Um. Optic rage. Right. Toughness. Increase maximum health. Oh, I can't do that. Accuracy. Leadership. Let's see what else. Kind of pointless putting it towards that. Damn, okay. I guess I'll put it in here. Let's rock. Come on, Cyclops. You ain't worth my time. I'm giving that on, I'm putting that on Cyclops. Since you're pretty squishy. Oh, I'm sorry, I have to... Motherfucker! Okay. The game's over, X-Men! Oh, I just started playing, goddammit. You're lucky you're still breathing. So, uh, Cyclops, you wanna come help me? I'll see you again, hey. X-Men. <laughs> okay, yep. I know how to... I know about that now. Garbage day. You are destined to lose, X-Men! Next time, you ain't getting up. And I'll take that for... for a Wolverine. Sweet. Too far if you want the... Oh, okay, so that's what L is gonna be for. Sweet. I was wondering what L is for, because I was pressing and it wasn't doing anything. 
Ow, dick. Because I can. Pull L during combat and your ally will attack your target. Oh, okay. Take another step closer, Blob. Try and stop me, Cream Puff. I can do the same thing. All this fighting is making me hungry. Oop. Physical resistance. I'm gonna use you then. I'm gonna hurt you a lot more than it hurt me. Oh, about that asshole. I need my power to do that. You can all right over the Wolverine. <laughs> oh, this fighting is making me hungry. Oh boy. Okay, so he's got resist. Oh boy. Ah. Wolverine, please. the AI is smart to like get out of the way of some things except that those combos without oh Jesus Christ eh. you weren't so tough now get Alice into the yeah. extra ain't no I'll one standing in my way treat some rain got it lob defeated okay so you leveled up Uh, you're level four. You're right. Oh, I recognize that move. That's usable right away. In uh, our Ultimate Alliance. Oh. Wondering if there's like a you can sell these instead of dropping them. Storm. Save game. You are destined to lose, X-Men. Go to hell. Then again, I kind of prefer Cyclops to be in the back there. Someone's not getting air conditioning. Okay. Um. 
guess we're going this way. This way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I did see this. It's developed by Raven. I will annihilate you. Oh, you ate shit. What is this? Comic book. Cyclops, please. What's your... What are you set at, by the way? AI... Okay, normal. Whatever. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. We good. Guess you didn't want a piece of me. I'm throwing someone off the roof. I did say I was going to throw someone off a roof. Let's say Marvel. Yeah, it does. <laughs> you are destined to lose, X Men. Oh, yeah. I'm help. I think she, at least she's invincible. Will do. I think she's invincible. <laughs> okay, Cyclops leveled up. Um. Alright, uh, what can we go do? Go do? What the hell is wrong with me? And make it more powerful. Fuck it. Yes. No. We just destroyed some tables for no apparent reason. This is impossible. I'm the best at what I do. Damn straight. <clears throat> so who's the best X-Men? I will annihilate you. You're going off a roof. Go that way. Oh, you can't! Damn it! Ah, oh, that's lame. Oh boy. Guess you didn't want a piece of me. I'm on it. Oh, there was probably like a root, like these ledges here that was preventing. Will do. <clears throat> Preventing me from throwing someone off. Oh, danger room disc. Oh. Okay. Oh, so it's like training stuff, I'm guessing? I like how that shit works. You ain't getting up from that. I keep hitting L. Yes. All right, where this way? Enter the exit. Yes. Woo.
The X Jet, aka a B2 stealth bomber. Me? Allison, it's okay. Things were fine until last week. I got mad at my little brother and suddenly the ground started to shake. I knew it was my fault, but I didn't want to admit it. Your powers are becoming active, which things have only gotten worse. That lava in the street? I made it happen. I'm becoming a mutant. There's nothing wrong with... And that woman? She was gonna make me join something called the Brotherhood. She could come after me again. Anytime! Allison, you couldn't be in safer hands. We're the X-Men. Woo! Do we get uh, pa Patrick Stewart or no? Professor Xavier, I'd like you to meet Allison Crestmere. Hello, Allison. Welcome to the Institute. How are you? Bootleg confused, Patrick Stewart. But I'm okay. That's understandable. Perhaps Jean could take you on a tour of the mansion. Or would you prefer that I show you the true purpose of the Institute in the sub basement? Uh. Why was I brought here? You were brought here for your own protection. The people who attacked you in New York City were members of the Brotherhood of Mutants. They can be extremely dangerous. So they could come after me again? Perhaps. Which is why it would be best for you to stay at the mansion. At least until we determine exactly why the Brotherhood attempted to kidnap you. Are you the leader of the X-Men? I prefer to think of myself as their mentor. I leave team leadership to Cyclops or Storm. But you brought them together, right? Yes. I started with Cyclops and several others. As time passed, I found more mutants who were capable of handling the responsibilities of being an X-Man. Mm, and... This. Who's the Brotherhood? The Brotherhood is an unruly collection of mutants who consider themselves above humanity. They operate outside the law and use their abilities to further their misguided desires. But what do they want? They've labeled themselves Homo Superior and believe they will inherit the Earth. But they are far from meek. I'd like Jean to show me around. It would be my pleasure. As you move from room to room, I'll give you a little information on the X-Men. Once you're done with Jean's tour, come back here, and I'll show you the sub-basement. Lead okay. the way, Allison. Game tip. There are many wonders to be found in the Xavier Mansion. Feel free to explore everything the mansion has to offer. Here you can access movies, view... <laughs> uh, looks like we're not going to be doing that. Do comic covers or visit the danger room to practice your fighting techniques. Okay, so the danger room is just like a. Did you have a question, Allison? This house is too cool. Who ah! is it? The Xavier Mansion is owned by Professor Charles Xavier. Once it was his family's estate, but he had bigger plans. Looks as if it hasn't changed since it was first built. Oh, it's had quite a bit of remodeling over the years, but we're very fussy about keeping things as close to the original design as possible. This place is huge. What kind of things are here? The mansion has dormitories for the students, a swimming pool, a library, and a huge lawn should you feel the need to stretch your legs. And who's Professor Xavier? Professor Xavier, or Professor X as some call him, is the founder of the X-Men. But perhaps more importantly, he's a teacher. What subject does he teach? Being a mutant. Okay. He's trying to help mutants and non-mutants learn that they can live together peacefully. So, Professor Xavier's a mutant too? Oh yes. <laughs> he's the most powerful telepath alive. I'll explore a little more. I'll ask again if I need more info. Welcome to the Xavier Institute, Allison. 
Wait, you didn't welcome? <laughs> this place is huge. What is it? This is the Xavier Institute. A Didn't you hear what I just fucking said? Control their abilities, as well as discovering more about themselves and their place in the world. A school for mutants? I, I didn't know there was such a thing. The fact that the students are mutants is kept secret for everyone's protection. In addition to being a school, the mansion is also home to the X-Men. Cool. I've heard of the X-Men. Okay. What room is this? The library is one of the most popular rooms in the house. There's a wide variety of literature here, from Shakespeare to comic books. It's an interesting mishmash of styles, kind of like the X-Men. Who are you? My name is Jean Grey, and I've been an X-Man most of my life. Today, in New York City, were you talking to people with your thoughts? Yes. My mutant abilities deal with telepathy and telekinesis. You're a mutant? Yes, I am. You'd be hard put to find someone around here who isn't. I didn't <laughs> think there were many people like me. Our numbers are growing, and it's nothing to be ashamed of, Allison. Even though there are a few people who would like you to be. And... You're telepathic? I have the ability to read minds and communicate mentally. And telekinesis means you can list stuff with your thoughts, right? Exactly. I've grown quite powerful at it over the years, but I doubt I'll ever master it. Okay. Thanks for the info. Um, let's take a look at the comics I've picked up. Wolverine comic. Cool. Ultimate X-Men. And the Magma comic. Okay. Let me in. Um. Classes are held here, Monday through Friday. The students receive a full curriculum in math, history, physics, and a wide variety of other topics. Hey. Okay. Hey! I'm gonna talk to you. Thanks. I'll ask again if I need more info. Well, I'm guessing there's really nothing here. This is just like a little side piece, huh? Yeah, it looks like it. This is the sitting room. It's oh. a great place to kick back and relax. Needless to say, this room doesn't get a lot of use by the X-Men. Why? Did you have... Thanks. I'll ask. Okay. This is the first floor elevator. From here, you can go to the second floor or the sub basement. I'll skip it for now. In an old house like this, I bet it's just full of cobwebs. You'd think that, wouldn't you? Okay. <laughs> this is the day room. It's beautiful, isn't it? There are times I find it hard to believe there's a high-tech underground level beneath this grand old mansion. An underground level? Oh, yes. But I'll leave that part of the tour to Professor Xavier. Is there a cheat code where I can play as Professor Xavier? <laughs> Believe it or not, we do take the time to sit down every once in a while and have a meal together. Just like any other family. I can't picture any of the X-Men actually cooking a meal. <laughs> you haven't lived till you've tasted Pete's barbecue or Betsy's Cornish hen. You haven't lived. I hate I hate when people say that. Oh, you haven't lived. Yeah, I've lived, asshat. Who the fuck you think you're talking to? The second floor of the mansion has bedrooms for many of the X-Men. Feel free to wander around and look in the rooms. Feel free to kick down the this door. This is the second floor elevator. 
From here, you can go to the first floor or the sub basement. Feel free to kick in the door of people and just invade their fucking privacy. This is Rogue's room. You like her? She's a bit of a wild child. She tends to get into trouble. Well, Rogue did a few questionable things before joining the X-Men, but she's proven herself to be an invaluable member of our team. If you don't mind me asking, what can she do? It's a bit complicated, but her power deals with direct skin contact, which is why she always wears gloves. Is it that her ability is that she copies the power of people who she touches, but she can only do like one? Aurora Monroe lives here. Her mutant abilities allow her oh, to storm. control the weather. Oh, Storm. That's her name? She okay. She's in handy with her favorite pastime gardening Aurora what a pretty name her code name is storm she takes over as leader of the X-Men if Scott Summers isn't around you go into Wolverine's room he just fucking attacks you <laughs> this is the home of Peter Rasputin he's pure Russian from oh for fuck's sakes to the bottom of his size 18 feet you never believe a body of steel could house such a gentle heart. What dude's last name is fucking Rasputin? This room belongs to the ultimate man of mystery, Wolverine. Although he's a bit rough around the edges, Wolvie's the best friend you could ever want, and the worst enemy you could possibly imagine. Mix the smoke. Oh, hey, what's this? Trivia game? Oh, fuck no. <laughs> oh, God. What's this? Concept art. Okay. Actually, no, let's try. Let's try. See how badly I fucked this up. Rogue had once been with... Damn it. <laughs> oh, fuck! Ah! Eh. Okay. <laughs> Which of these X Men characters. Hey! 6 XP? Oh, this one I know. Um, okay. I just took a wild guess. Nightcrawler is originally from... Okay. <laughs> oh, that I know. Who is, Cyclops has a brother? <laughs> okay, I just, just took a guess at that. Uh, uh, um, Area 51. Mutant research. Okay. <laughs> Who is not truly a mutant? Okay. Wait, really? I suppose he's just a big guy with this... Fucking armor shit. Wolverine was forced to slay the father of the woman he loved. What was the father? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm embarrassing myself here. Um. Uh, <laughs> suppose I could stop anytime I want. Who developed Sentinels as a deterrent to mutants? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, she's magma? Uh, okay.
What's this? I don't even know what that is, but that sounds awesome. <laughs> okay, so she looks like she's a magic user. I'm gonna put something into there. Okay, I embarrassed myself enough as it is, so let's go. Of course, Wolver- wait, Wolverine's Canadian? Okay, well. I mean, I don't have an issue with that, I was just like, oh, huh. I figured he'd be like, at least... Maybe New England? This room belongs to Scott Summers. You met him in New York, the guy with the optic blasts. He was the very first X-Man, and he's the team leader. Oh yeah, I remember him. He's kinda cute. And he's kinda spoken for. Oh, I, I didn't mean to. I'm just teasing, Allison. Scott and I have been together forever. I'm lucky to have him. So, um... <clears throat> oh, speaking of which. Uh, one of the, uh missions in Ultimate Alliance is to save Jean Grey. Well, instead from Mephisto, I instead, uh, and it became a choice between Nightcrawler and Jean. Well, I chose Jean, which caused the bad ending of Mystique to kill Xavier. This is my bedroom. I've lived here off and on since I was a teenager. The X-Mansion is pretty much the only real home I've ever known. Okay. This. This is your room, Allison. If you want it. I bet you'd find the mansion a great place to learn about your abilities. I'm not sure if I want to learn about them. After what happened in New York, maybe it'd be best if I never use them again. But Allison, if you don't learn to control your abilities now, they could wind up causing far more damage later on. I suppose you're right. Still, I don't know. This must be... I'm going to take a guess. This is Nightcrawler's room. This is Hank McCoy's room. Oh. They call him Beast, but oh, I can't. an insult. You'll find out why when you meet him. To look at him, you'd never guess he was such a bookworm. Okay, get him away. Oh, what's this? Review load screens? What's this? Okay. Cyclops. Mansion upstairs. Okay, so the, you just... <laughs> you just unlock these by just... To them. Wait. What's the difference between two? Okay. Oh, one says New York, the other one just says X Jet. <laughs> okay. The fuck ever. This door leads to the front lawn where there's a beautiful fountain. You can go see it in a little while. It's a great place to sit and read or write. Really? My two favorite things are reading romance novels and writing in my diary. Lame. And see, we're two of a kind. Later on, we'll have to get together and swap books. Lame. Lame. Well, what's out this way? This door takes you to the backyard. A little later, you'll have to go out and see the swimming pool. I'm gonna go out there and see it now. Uh. So where is the spot where I can see movies? You lied to me. Did you have a question, Al? Wait, 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 
Thanks. I'll ask again if I need more info. X-Men bios. Lorraine. Hold on. Go back. She was initially given the code name Marvel Girl. Marvel Girl. Why? Did you have a quest? No, I'm trying to talk to Thanks. Xavier. Hello, Allison. Are you ready to see the true purpose of the Institute? Could you take me on the sub-basement tour? Yes, indeed. You see, a majority of this facility is underground, so as not to attract the attention of those who mean ill Where'd you get the funding people? for this? It features state-of-the-art training equipment that helps prepare the X-Men for any challenges they may encounter. That screenshot looks like it's taken straight this from is the movie. The war room. From here, we keep a watchful eye on the world for any signs of trouble. This is also where the X-Men meet to formulate combat strategies. What's that holographic globe? It's the Earth, dumbass. Is the mission control <laughs> computer. With it, you can examine and activate <laughs> any missions that are currently available to the X-Men. I'll have to take a look at that later. Very good. Now, would you like a tour of the sub-basement, or would you prefer to explore on your own? Uh... I'd like a sub-basement tour. Feel free to inspect the rooms. I'll follow along and explain as we go. <laughs> oh. You know what this means? There's a hack where you can control Xavier. His, um... Movements are a bit jank. <laughs> Thank you. We're rather proud of it. Seemed so, uh... Oh. oh, it's the... Uh... From within here, I control battle situations that take place in the training room you can see through those windows. The training room has earned the dubious title of the Danger Room. But the Danger Room looks completely empty. With the aid of advanced holography, any adversary or environment can be created out of nothingness. The Danger Room can simulate battle situations from the surface of the moon to 1,000 feet below... Why? <laughs> Holographs. So nothing in there is real. Make no mistake. While the enemies in the Danger Room may not be real, the danger certainly is, as the bruises of the X-Men can attest. What's the console over there? That is the Danger Room computer. What's it do? It is the artificial intelligence created by Beast to run the Danger Room. With it, a student can access any of the training programs available. You may use it later, should you wish. Sounds kind of scary, but fun. <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way, Allison, because I would now like to officially extend you an invitation to join us here at the Institute. Your parents hoped you would stay to see if we could help you learn to control your mutant abilities. I... I don't know. This is all happening so fast. There's no rush. This is a difficult decision. So for the time being, consider yourself our guest. Feel free to enjoy anything the mansion has to offer. Okay. <laughs> Age room disc. What does this do? Teamwork 102. What are like extra like bonus shit that I can get? Oh, can't go through there. Okay. His movements are a bit weird. Save game.
This is the Brig, a highly reinforced area designed to contain practically any mutant. You keep prisoners? No, no, not at all, Allison. But there are those rare occasions when we need to detain an individual before handing them over to the proper authorities. Put me in! Oh. Enemy bios! Steak. Bob. Put me in. Close the door. Yeah. This is our medical facility. We've gone to a great deal of trouble to design equipment capable of handling the special needs of mutants. I believe that if necessary, these computers could even perform surgery without supervision. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> so yeah, I am generally curious if you can go back to previous missions and kind of level grind because you can do that in ultimate alliance where you can go back to a previous mission that you've done if you want to level up um, your characters and get coins to your yes, shit what can i do for oh, was the to never mind Let this is the laboratory of hank mccoy a gifted scientist and engineer he was one of my first students at the institute isn't he the one they call Beast? Yes, but that code name is a gross misrepresentation of the man. His mind is every bit as strong and agile as his body. It's his technical expertise that keeps the equipment down here running so smoothly. It's really nothing I can interact with here, huh? Okay. The X Jet Hangar. The hangar bay houses the X Men's main source of transportation. We call it the X Jet, a state of the art and constantly upgraded aircraft. It's a fucking stealth wow. bomber. That's cool. <laughs> Indeed. We keep the X Jet prepped and ready to take off at a moment's notice. <laughs> it's just a B 52 stealth bomber. That's all. <laughs> Marvel lazy shits? Oh Jesus Christ, what the hell are these things? Xavier is into nuclear warfare. Can I go in it? Okay. What the hell's a sub basement anyway? Anyway, is it just a basement? These are the transport tubes. A quick way of getting to the second floor of the mansion. But I didn't see any entrance to the tubes on the second floor. They're hidden, since the tubes are only used in emergencies. Okay. <laughs> uh, any other spots? It doesn't look like it. What's this? Hello, my friends. Oh, I'm not an X-Man. I'm just looking around the war room. Professor Xavier said it was okay. I saw this flashing button marked Muir Island, so I pushed it. Are you having trouble there? Yes, the Brotherhood stormed through here. Oh my gosh! Were you hurt? Me? I'm fine. Who are you? My name's Forge. I bet you've got some kind of mutant power, don't you? I have the ability to build any type of machine. <laughs> okay, okay, so... Uh... He's just useless. 
What was the Brotherhood doing on Mir Island? They broke into my workshop and tore the place apart in search of a particular piece of equipment. What did they want? They took some experimental equipment that masks mutant DNA from scanning devices. Why would they want that? Take a guess. Hmm. I'm not sure. But while wearing the masking device, even Cerebro would not be able to detect them. Talk to you later, Forge. Anytime. Beginning with your next away mission, you can visit Forge's workshop through extraction points in your mission. Buy and sell. Okay, cool. <laughs> Oh, they're called tech bits. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm good. Hey, don't yes, fucking walk away from me. I'm done with the sub basement tour. Um, oh, well, speaking of which, I guess I can equip some shit on her, huh? Oh. Hello again. Talk to you. Anytime. Wait, but I thought I could uh, go to Forge's thing, right? Oh shit. Um. I want to meet the various X-Men. Just take me out. Whoa! Oh, it's a cere Oh, it's that thing. <laughs> the Cerebro. Okay, how do I go up? It's the elevator. It's the elevator. Prof X. Really? You couldn't put F Professor on there fully? Oh, I'm assuming these X markers are like indicators. Ah, okay. They're like indicators on what I can interact with. Why? Oh, hey. Hey, y'all. Aren't you the new girl? Wow, cool costume. You've got to be an X-Man. No That's shit. Right, huh? My name's Rogue. And you're a mutant. Yup. My power lets me absorb all kinds of things through skin contact. That's why I thought. Other mutant powers, memories, even someone's life force if I'm not careful. But it only lasts for a short time, and then I return to normal. Or, <laughs> at least as normal as I can be. Where'd you get that accent? She's southern, Where'd I'm you guessing. Get that accent? Come on now, sugar. Y'all don't mean to tell me a yank like you has never met someone from the south. Yeah, what the fuck? I was in New Jersey once. <laughs> well, honey, I grew up in a little town along the bank of the Mississippi River. I'm as southern as mint juleps and magnolia trees. You're lucky. At least you've got a mutant power that's easy to hide. Oh, it's not that easy, Allison. I can never touch someone without taking something from them. Oh, right. I never thought of that. Once, I bumped into Nightcrawler and I was blue for a week. That sucks. Me too? Never you mind, sweetheart. You'll know him when you see him. Talk to you later. Don't be a stranger, y'all. 
What is the onomatopoeia that they use for Nightcrawler when he vanishes? I could have sworn it was something like BAMF. Iceman. Wow, the scenery around here just improved 100%. Gene said you were cute, but that was the understatement of the century. You must be Bobby Drake. Hey, it's nice to see my name's gotten around. Did the other girls tell you what a cool dude I am? Shut the fuck no, up. No, but Jean Grey warned me to keep an eye on you. Oh, well, don't believe everything Jean says. She still hasn't forgiven me for that little incident in the changing room. Man, you enter one room without knocking and you're branded for life. Uh, <laughs> we're just gonna skip past that. I've heard you have the mutant power to freeze anything instantly. Yep. I can drop my body temperature in the air around me to sub-zero temperatures. It lets me cover my body in a protective shield of ice that even bullets can't get through. Pretty wicked, huh? I've got yeah, fire. I'll say. <laughs> but enough about me. Let's talk about you. It's always nice to meet a new student, especially one as pretty as you. Thanks, Bobby. But I'm not sure I want to be a student. Aw, oh, come on. It's a lot of fun. Plus, you learn how to use your powers. I'm not sure. Being able to generate lava kind of freaks me out. <laughs> you get used to having mutant powers. After a while. Eventually, you'll even get to like them. I hope to see you soon, Bobby. Oh, you can count on that, Allison. There's on a list. <laughs> Cinematics. Oh! Okay, cinematics. Okay, Whew. thought they would have included cl like clips from like shows or some shit. And we talked to Rogue. I think I was already this way. What about in here? I don't think. Okay. Wolverine's gonna be in his room. I'm gonna bust in there like, hey, get out. Hello? Hello? Don't wanna talk to me? I want over in here? No? How about over here? Yeah? No? Yeah. What the fuck? Who's that? Some random person. Wait. What fucking room is this? Must be night crawlers? Why, you must be Allison Kressmere. You're even prettier than Jean said you were. And you are? My name is Aurora Monroe, but here at the X Mansion, I'm usually referred to as Storm. Where are you from? I'm originally from Kenya, Africa. So I'll say it's but from Professor Africa, Xavier but I didn't. Ask me to join him here at the mansion. You're a mutant? I'm a teacher and a gardener. And yes, I'm also a mutant. I have the ability to control the weather. No way! I can make it rain, sleet, or snow. Even lightning. I can also control the wind, which allows me to fly. Okay. Professor Xavier told me about the danger room. What's it like in there? Stressful and exhilarating. You can never be sure what the professor or beast is going to throw at you. Aren't you afraid of being hurt? No. There are safety locks to protect us from serious harm. 
but the danger room does have a habit of leaving you with a few aches and pains. I'll see you later. I hope to see you soon, Allison. You know, at least they can read the ellipses. It does bother me when whenever someone like reads like some sort of uh, dialogue and they get to the ellipses, they just kind of skip over that. <laughs> okay, I don't think. Objectives. I don't know what other X-Men there is. <clears throat> unless they're unless they're uh, down in the sub basement now, I guess. Okay. Oh. Oh. I wasn't in the staying in the correct spot, I understand. Okay, maybe there's some people down here now. Here. Ray. Hello, Allison. Are you finding a way around all right? Yes. I'm just exploring. So you and Cyclops are an item, huh? It was a long time coming, but yes. Eventually we managed to get together. But isn't it difficult dating someone when you're a telepath? There'd be no surprises. Oh, I would never read a person's mind unless I was given permission. But because of my powers, Scott and I have developed a permanent psychic bond. A psychic bond? Anywhere I go, I can always feel his presence, just as he can feel mine. I guess you could say we're soulmates. Lame. What's that beam that shoots out of Cyclops' eyes? It's called an optic blast, and it's powerful enough to punch a hole through carbon steel. Where does the energy come from? His eyes. Scott's body absorbs solar energy and converts it into power for the beam. <laughs> Why does Cyclops always wear those glasses? As a child, Scott was in an accident that damaged his ability to control his optic energy. As a result, his optic beam is constantly active. The only way he can shut it off is to close his eyes. So his power's kind of stuck in permanent on mode. Yes. Fortunately, Professor X created a visor with ruby quartz lenses that block the beam. That way Scott can open his eyes without destroying everything in sight. But, regrettably, I'll never get to see his eyes because of it. I should be going now. Anytime you feel the need for a little girl talk, just let me know. Okay. Well, I'm guessing the story of X-Men Legends is going to be revolving around Allison here. Or is Allison kind of like the tutorial character? Oh. Anyone in here? No! I'm gonna keep looking for a little bit longer and then I'm gonna throw up an intermission and then I think I'll continue playing this. Have I done the objectives yet? Oh, apparently there's a couple more people to talk to. Oh, I can't go that way. Um, not that way. What about, uh, do the hangar? Gotta be someone in there, right? Uh, I just went that way. That's the elevator. Oh, hey, there it is. Or a beast. I'm sorry, miss. My sincerest apologies if I frightened you. Are you Hank McCoy? Yes, indeed. Although my codename is Beast, for 
obvious reasons. Because they couldn't figure out a better name. My animalistic appearance is due to a further genetic mutation. Aren't you Alison Crestmere? The young lady they aided in New York today? Yeah. I'm sure everyone's heard of me. I'm the freak who can turn a mini mall into mini Pompeii. Alison, my dear. You are most certainly not a freak. You are a mutant. Just as I am. Mm -hmm. Since you're a scientist, could you explain to me exactly what a mutant is? It would be my pleasure. You see, Mother Nature has a way of changing life forms. Experimenting with them to see what would better help a species to thrive in its environment. That's evolution. Like what Darwin wrote about. Uh-oh, banned by Christians. Allison. Correct. And recently, evolution has decided to endow various humans with an X gene, which is what gives us special abilities. So mutants are really just the next phase in human evolution, and the X-Men strive to be the conscience of this new breed. It's quite exciting. The people in New York didn't think it was exciting when I started making lava burst out of the ground. I bet my friend Mandy will never talk to me again. You never know what the future may hold. In the meantime, you have new friends, Allison. A whole mansion full of mutants who know exactly what you're going through. Okay. Thanks for the talk, Beast. My pleasure, Allison. Feel free to drop by any time. Perhaps we could discuss Darwinism in greater detail. Uh. Shit, I was about to say something. Yeah, what it was gonna be. Yeah, what I was gonna say. Uh, anyone in here? Did I talk to everyone? Oh, I haven't. Someone in here, please talk to me. Unless this is one of those deals where I can just like say fuck you and just leave. Um No one here. Can I go out into the front yard or no? Ugh. Suppose I can save here. I always save often. Um, ground floor. Okay, can I go out here? The fucking front the area is like under construction right now. Please disappear. Ugh. Uh no. Also, side note, if the door is closed, wouldn't you knock? Like uh bre? Kinda think about that. That's kind of uh, his fault. <laughs> well, there's no one here. Who else do I need to talk to? Oh. What's this? Oh, okay. Already read that. Where is everyone? Okay, there's Rogue. Already talked to her. Ice Man's over that way. Don't care. Um. Already talked to Storm.
Yeah, this must be uh, Iceman's room. Considering. Wait, is this one of those things where if I were to do this? Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's good. Oh, I can do top down. That doesn't make Scott show so Scott show up. Okay. A muty. A weird fucking nickname, but okay. Need more chalk. <laughs> Oh, don't tell me. Go to the war room, start next mission. But it won't let me! It says, hey, you need to complete the objectives. What's up, basement? Unless there's someone in the war room. And I just didn't see it. Hey, what's this way? Oh. Okay, no. Okay, there's someone in here. With the aid of Cerebro, I've learned the Brotherhood is en route to Alaska. It appears their destination is the facility for the high-frequency active auroral research program, also known simply as HARP. What would the Brotherhood want at HARP? All that facility does is study the ionosphere. That, Cyclops, is what you must discover. The Brotherhood has become extremely active since their attack on Allison, which can only mean something sinister is in the offing. And whatever their plan, we must thwart it before they can set back the cause of human-mutant relations. The HARP facility, eh? This will be an excellent opportunity to test the new cloaking device I've installed on the X-Jet. It should render us completely undetectable to radar. Excellent, Beast. You have your mission, X-Men. Godspeed. Godspeed. I mean, yeah, I'm not expecting them to get Patrick Stewart on, but still. Oh. Hmm. Well, obviously, I got to bring Wolverine. But who else do I want to bring? Jesus Christ. Um. Apparently, you need to level up, buddy. Toughness. 
Acro. Ooh. <laughs> Did not want to do that. Sons of bitches. No, back. You're going down. Oh, fuck me. Yeah. Hey, who said that? Okay. Details. Um. Mutant Master. Point blank. What's this do? Uh. Wait, wait, wait. What? What does this do? Okay. Well. And you leveled up. Uh yeah, I need I need you to have some health there. Flight. Oh, it costs energy. Okay. Um back place details. Flight. Flight is always good. Yeah, you need that. Back. Details. Might. Oh, you got might. What the hell? Okay, you're, you're a punchy... You're, you're, you're very punchy, so... Shit. Do I want to put it towards that? Yeah, I think having some mobility is going to be the best. Back to this. Now, second thought, I got like too many... I want to have a half team of melee, of strikers in the... And... I'm going to replace you with... Rogue. Okay. That's good. Okay. Yeah, you're 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 punchy. What's this do? Yeah, you you are punch, right. so that's good. Got it. Yeah. Someone wants some. Who wants some? Okay. Oh. Sorry about that. Oh, cool. All right. I'm gonna throw a pause, and we're gonna throw up an intermission here. <laughs> All right. Time to stretch. Let's get back to business. Alright, here we go. I will... Oh. I thought that was an explosive. Oh. It's just storm. Um... Going here because I kind of want rogue. There's a way I can get him to like, right? Oh, I think they'll only use the powers, which is a bit annoying. Oh, one one second again.
Okay, maybe this will help. I'm having like this weird thing with my nose happening now. So I popped in a cough drop to kind of help out. Anyway. Let's just explore a bit. It looks like there's nothing going on. Time you freaks learned a lesson. <laughs> Dick. Okay, apparently that did nothing. Rogue, where are you going? Maybe you ought to stay down. No, wait, that was Storm. Oh. Combo. Oh, nice. You ain't getting up from that. Oh, you get XP from doing combos. That's cool. What's this say? In fact, I'm like... Ah! gonna say I'm gonna go to the next checkpoint and then I'm gonna move on to Harry Fick. Now I'm really ready for a spark. Hey everybody be leveling up. The hell is this? Oh okay Southern Strike. God damn it. <laughs> you increase your defense, focus. I couldn't give any less of a fuck about. Critical Strikes. Back. Wolverine leveled up. Oh, level 15. God damn it. Sure, let's... That. And then... Whoa! Okay, good enough. Uh, the next checkpoint I see... I think I said that already. Let's see what you got. We'll Cyclops. Do. Got it. Right. We'll do. Right. Wait, right. Oh, Storm's about to level up soon. I need to go back. Because if that's one of the objectives, I'll make sure I didn't miss any. This wasn't that far as I thought it was going to be. Uh, extraction. This doesn't count as the... ...finding. Um, I'm going to play Cyclops with us. Iceman. Iceman. I'm assuming it's Iceman that...
Christ, where the hell am I going? Stay near me. You bet. Okay. Okay. See what this says again. Characters can use their empowers to affect the environment in unique ways. Experiment with various powers when you see the blue. Right. Right. Okay, so I'm assuming it has to be you. Oh. <laughs> right. Might as well carry Iceman with me so he can get some level. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the hell was that? So yeah, hopefully uh, the application I made is going to kind of get me to play some of these games that I'm like, haven't really played and because I've been like holding off on doing that until I started streaming. So I guess we just move on. Wolverine giving you the middle finger. Okay. Time you freaks learned a lesson. Hell yeah. Storm leveled up. Good shit. Um, I think giving you more th more health would be good. Um, what else? Yeah. Hold on. I know you're getting your ass kicked, but, uh... Yeah, that requires a little more. Put it in there, fine. Alright. Time you freaks learned a lesson! Oh. 
Uh, you guys gonna do anything about, you know, getting shot at? Or is that just not gonna happen? fire. Okay. Detail. Yes. Um. Turn that onslaught. I must... Oh, yeah. Up there. Oh, what's this? Let's see what you got. You bet. Bitch. I just like you using Wolverine. Hmm. Guess the old one's back here. Time you freaks learn to listen. Dick. Get any cooler. Beat the shit out of a inanimate object. People leveled up, huh? Fire's <laughs> uh. level five. Um, wait, what? Wait, hold on. What does that say? Adds lightning damage to melee attacks. Oh, cool. That's going to be the case. We might as well start getting you up on that, too, huh? Right. Okay. Okay. Will do. You bet. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Back here. Guess we're going to... Oh, hey! <clears throat> Here's the other checkpoint. <clears throat> All right. Save my game, and we're going to move on to Heretic here. <laughs> 